All right, it's Josh Jordan, founder of Prehired. We've got David Stewart here in Seattle, Washington. He's just finished the program. Uh, within three weeks, already had a job offer at a great company. Uh, David, go ahead and tell everyone a little bit about your background, man. Yeah, so I'm uh, not a sales guy. I'm actually, it was a pastor for the last 12 years, but uh, due to young family, uh, wanted to make a career shift into something else. Started doing some research and uh, decided I wanted to go into inside sales. So this is my first job and my first experience inside of sales. Now, first off, why, why inside sales or why sales? And then second part of my question to follow up with that is uh, why pre-hired? So inside sales, um, th there's a lot of cool companies, a lot of stuff happening, really good benefits, really good comp and pay packages, better flexibility in terms of time. That's why, uh, why pre-hired, I wanted to make a career shift and I knew that it was an entirely new shift. And as I started looking for these jobs and was seeing them, there was terms and, and, and stuff I had no idea about. I didn't even know the terminology. So I'm like, man, I need some help. That's when I came across a Facebook ad of pre-hire. All right. So, yeah, you found us on uh, probably one of our, our posts that we had on Facebook. Uh, when you read it, you did your research. Ultimately, though, did you have any doubts? I mean, what were you thinking right before you clicked to go ahead and sign up and, and become a member of our program? Yeah, I mean, I think everyone's got some doubts. But for me, I guess what made me decide to go take a chance with you guys was uh, your confidence in the, you know, we're going to get you hired in the career field that you're looking for in 90 days. And I thought, you know, even if they can't quite pull that off, even if it's like maybe 120 days, you know, 90 days or so, a whole new career field at least made me know that you guys believed in, in it. And so I was willing to take a shot then. All right, and, and obviously though, uh, it wasn't 90 days for you, it was uh, 21 days for you. So tell us a little bit about your new job and, and kind of the, the opportunity you're starting now. Yeah, so I'm starting in just a couple days. I got my job offer about a week ago with Avo, a really cool company right downtown Seattle, really cool culture, a very generous base salary, complete full benefits, and a completely uncapped commission pay structure. So the exact kind of job that you guys discussed in, in your, your video, the exact kind of job I ended up with. And, and to get that though, because this is on everyone's mind that's watching. You just described a great dream job that all these other salespeople want to get. If they're not already in tech, they want to get into tech sales. They want to get a job like you described at a great company, exciting work, challenging coworkers that will make them better, great pay, flexibility. Um, in order to get to that level though, you had to go through the program. You had to complete it. I mean, how was that for you? What was that experience like going through our system and our program? Was it easy? Was it difficult? Just share a little bit about that. Yeah. Well, I mean, like you said, it's a system and it's a process and I'd say don't do it. If you're just thinking that you're going to just pay the enrollment money and end up with a certificate, uh, you have to go through the program. I myself, you know, I submitted my first round of certification stuff. You guys had some directions, but Going through the process, if you know that you you are diligent, you know that you're you're going to be willing to go to the process and trust it I, for it absolutely because you guys have it in a in a sequence and, and a methodology that makes sense. Um, it builds, and so for me that kept me going at a pretty fast pace. But um, you got to be diligent. You should expect to do some work, um, but but if you're willing to, and that's your mindset that I'd say definitely. Yeah. And, and thanks for mentioning that, David. It's, it, you know, my mindset too for running sales teams is uh, if we're going to instruct you and mentor you on to do uh, these steps, take these actions and you're going to get these, these results. If you don't get those results, that's my fault as a sales manager. I told you what to do. You didn't get results after listening to me. That's my fault. That's why we do have the guarantee that if you're not hired in 90 days, we give a full refund. I mean, we back that. But on the other hand, I love that you said, if you're not going to follow the program, you're not going to be diligent and, and listen to people and yeah. take instruction, then uh, you're not going to like this program because it's not going to work for you. And guess what? When you ask for a refund, you will not get a refund. If you do not follow the system and you just quit after a week or you just change your mind, we do not reward that behavior because a salesperson who joins my sales team, guess what happens? If, if they say, uh, tell me, Josh, how do I do this? How do I get results? And I tell you, and they do their own thing. Whose fault is that? Mine or theirs? Theirs. Right. So, 
Hey, so I just yep. want to go ahead and say that's the way we run our sales team. That's the way we, we interact with our members. If you're committed to this, um, we would love to have you in the program. But I just had to say that I'm very passionate about getting the best people into our program, getting them trained. Because uh, it doesn't matter if you don't have the skills. As long as you're willing to learn and you're teachable and you've got a great attitude, uh, we can get you the, the other missing parts that, that you're missing. So the last thing I want to ask you, David, uh, as I ended my tangent, um, what would you say to anyone who's – they've heard about us, man, they've been – reading our emails or blogs, watching the videos of other members like you, but they're still on the fence. I mean, what would you say to someone who's still considering this, but just hasn't pulled the trigger yet? I'd say do it and invest in yourself. I mean, in my opinion, the, the best asset you will always have is yourself. And I wanted to build an entire new skill set. Um, and, and so I did that. If you're out there looking, um, if you do follow the steps and you gain a new set of knowledge as I did, um, it, it's going to be beneficial. So my opinion is go for it, do it, be diligent, set aside the time, uh, and invest in yourself. David, thanks for sharing your story with us. Enjoy, uh, the weekend, um, up in Seattle, uh, stay safe hiking, but, um, it, man, I can't wait to hear more results as you start your job next week. Yeah, right on.